I've set a goal of zero carbon for aviation sector, for example, by 2050. I've spoken with the leading heads of all major airlines. It's going to require billions of gallons of sustainable aviation fuel. And you simply can't get to net zero by 2050 without biofuels. <laughs> aviation. <laughs> aviation is the case where you blend in a little bit of biofuel. It's where it's called drop-in, meaning 100 percent biofuel. You don't need to take my word for it. Take the word of the CEO of American Airlines who said, sustainable aviation fuel is the cornerstone of our strategy, end of quote. And the CEO of United Airlines, who called the first biofuel-powered flight a significant milestone for our efforts to decarbonize our industry. To bring that future within reach, I proposed a sustainable aviation fuel tax that we brought together the government's agencies, aircraft manufacturers, airlines, fuel producers, airports, advanced, cleaner, and more sustainable fuels for American aviation. That's how we're going to get there. And we can. We're in the cusp of so many significant things that are going to happen in this country, not just in the fuel side, but in the next 10 years. Your children are going to see more change in the next 10 years than we've seen in the last 40 years. That's how rapidly technology is changing.